Clone Alpha is a humanoid robot unlike anything we've seen before. Built by Clone Robotics, this machine is designed with synthetic organs, artificial muscles, and a structure that mirrors human anatomy down to the smallest detail. This isn't just about creating a robot that looks like us. It's about replicating how the human body works. The company is now accepting pre-orders for the first 279 units of Clone Alpha, marking a significant step in their journey to bring lifelike robotics into homes and workplaces. What makes Clone Alpha stand out is its biomimetic design, which is a fancy way of saying it's built to imitate biological systems. Instead of using traditional motors and actuators, Clone Robotics has developed synthetic versions of human organ systems. For instance, the robot has a polymer skeleton that mimics the 206 bones in the human body, complete with articulated joints and artificial ligaments. These features give it an incredible range of motion. Its upper body alone has 164 points of articulation, with each hand, wrist, and elbow combination offering 26 degrees of freedom. That kind of flexibility is rare even in advanced robotics. The real game changer here is the muscular system. Clone Robotics developed something called myofiber technology, which uses artificial muscles that contract with water pressure. These muscles are soft and lightweight, yet powerful. A single muscle fiber, weighing just 3 grams, can generate a kilogram of force and contract 30% of its length in under 50 milliseconds. This allows Clone Alpha to move in ways that are fluid and lifelike, a sharp contrast to the rigid, mechanical motions of traditional robots. Powering this muscle system is a compact hydraulic pump that functions much like a human heart. It circulates fluid through the robot's vascular system, delivering the pressure needed for muscle contractions. The pump is remarkably efficient, operating at 500 watts while delivering 40 liters per minute of hydraulic fluid at 100 psi. To manage this system, Clone Robotics designed specialized valves called AquaJets. These valves operate on just one watt of power and ensure precise control over fluid flow, enabling the robot's movements to be both smooth and energy efficient. Clone Alpha's nervous system is another standout feature. It combines multiple layers of sensors and computational models to control its movements. The robot is equipped with four depth cameras for visual input, 70 inertial sensors to monitor joint positions, and 320 pressure sensors embedded in its muscles to provide feedback on force. These inputs are processed in real time by microcontrollers, which relay the data to a powerful NVIDIA Jetson Thor GPU running Clone's CyberNet model. This setup allows the robot to have proprioceptive awareness, meaning it knows where its limbs are in space and can adjust its movements accordingly. The company claims Clone Alpha can perform a variety of tasks straight out of the box. It comes preloaded with 16 skills, such as memorizing the layout of a home, tracking kitchen inventory, and performing household chores like vacuuming, setting the dining table, and folding clothes. It can even pour drinks and make sandwiches, which is a nice touch for anyone dreaming of a robotic assistant. The robot is also designed to interact with humans in meaningful ways. It can engage in witty dialogue, shake hands, and even hold items for you. For those looking to customize their robot's capabilities, Clone Alpha includes a platform called Telekinesis, which allows users to teach it new skills. The story of Clone Alpha is rooted in the vision of Clone Robotics's founders, CEO Danush Radhakrishnan and CTO Lucas Kozlik. They've been working on this concept for years, starting with smaller projects like a robotic hand and a humanoid torso. These prototypes showcase the potential of their technology with lifelike movements and functionality that set them apart in the robotics field. The robotic hand, for example, featured a rotating thumb and could catch a ball with precision, while the torso demonstrated realistic shoulder and spinal movements. One of the key decisions that shaped Clone Alpha was the choice to use water-powered muscles instead of traditional motors. This approach gives the robot a softer, more human-like quality. Making it better suited for tasks that require delicacy and precision. It also allows for more compact and efficient designs as the hydraulic system eliminates the need for bulky mechanical components. This focus on biomimetics, designing machines that mimic biological systems, has been at the core of Clone Robotics' philosophy since the company was founded in 2021. Despite the impressive technology, Clone Alpha hasn't yet been demonstrated as a fully integrated system. While the company has showcased individual components like the robotic hand and torso, 
it hasn't released footage of the complete humanoid robot in action. This has led to some skepticism about whether the technology can deliver on its promises. Building a robot that moves like a human is one thing. Scaling that technology for production and ensuring it works reliably is a much bigger challenge. The company is aware of these challenges, but remains optimistic. The limited production run of 279 units is a strategic choice, allowing the company to focus on refining the technology and gathering feedback from early adopters. The goal is to demonstrate that their biomimetic approach is not just a theoretical concept, but a practical solution for real-world applications. But the applications for Clone Alpha extend beyond the home. The founders envision their robot being used in workplaces and industrial settings, where its human-like movements could make it easier to integrate into existing workflows. For example, in a factory environment, Clone Alpha could perform tasks alongside human workers without requiring major changes to the assembly line. This adaptability could make it a valuable tool in industries ranging from manufacturing to healthcare. One of the most intriguing aspects of Clone Alpha is its potential for continuous learning. The telekinesis platform enables users to teach the robot new skills by guiding its movements and programming responses. This opens up endless possibilities for customization, allowing the robot to adapt to specific needs and environments. Imagine training your robot to handle unique tasks in your home or workplace, making it a truly personalized assistant. The technology behind Clone Alpha is undeniably impressive, but it's also a reminder of how far robotics has come in a relatively short time. Just a few years ago, the idea of a robot with synthetic organs and water-powered muscles would have seemed like science fiction. Today, it's a reality, albeit one that's still in the early stages of development. Clone Robotics has set a high bar for itself, and the success of Clone Alpha will depend on how well the company can execute its vision. For now, Clone Alpha remains a fascinating example of what's possible when engineering meets biology. Its synthetic organs, advanced muscle technology, and lifelike movements represent a new direction for robotics, one that prioritizes adaptability and human-like functionality. Whether it becomes a game changer or just a stepping stone to something greater, it's clear that Clone Alpha is a robot worth watching. As the first units are prepared for production, the world will be watching to see if Clone Robotics can deliver on its bold promises. With such advanced technology and a clear vision for the future, the company has the potential to reshape how we think about humanoid robots. Whether it's in the home, the workplace, or beyond, Clone Alpha is poised to leave a lasting impact on the field of robotics. All right. <laughs> Let me know what you think in the comments, and uh, if you enjoyed this, make sure to like and subscribe for more AI updates. Um, thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.